It's cookie time. Hi, I'm Brenda. Welcome to Nana's Hidden Apron. Welcome to my kitchen. We're going to make some uh, no-bake cookies. They're no-bake, but technically you do have to cook them. <laughs> just on the stove top. I've already got the things, uh, all the ingredients measured out. So I'm gonna tell you real quick what I've got here. I have uh, some butter, I have cocoa powder, milk, sugar, quick oats. You have to use the quick cook. Don't use the old fashioned, use quick cook. And that is a uh, cup of smooth peanut butter. You can use the chunky if you like it. And some vanilla. The first thing that I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to put that stick of butter in there and then I'm going to add the sugar and I'm going to put my cocoa powder in there. What I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to heat this up and let the uh, butter melt. And then I'm going to add my milk to it. And then uh, I'm going to bring this to a boil. But once it comes to a rolling boil, I'm just going to let it boil for three minutes. And then um, I'll take it off of the stove, add the oats and the peanut butter. Then, uh, once those mix in pretty good, then I'll add the vanilla to it. So, let me get this going and... Uh, Maybe I didn't say, but once I get this uh, butter melted, then I'm going to add the milk in. So let me get this going, get my uh, mixture to a bowl, uh, and you want to stir it often. Make sure it don't stick to your pan or anything. But let me get this going, and I'll be right back with you. Stirring it, stirring it, and stirring it. And that's what I'm going to keep doing until this butter melts, and we get it going to that uh, rolling bowl for three minutes. So um, check back with you in a few minutes. All right, we have our boil going. This smells so good, y'all. I'm just telling you. It uh, has most of the same ingredients that my mama would make her chocolate fudge with. This, well, as a matter of fact, it's got everything that she would have put in it, with the exception of a pinch of salt. Uh, this that's on here right now, I mean. But yeah, yeah. She would fill us full of that sweet, sweet chocolate candy in the winter time. Ah! Sorry, that's Brinkley. That's Mr. Yorkie. We'll just keep on giving it a stir. Let it boil like this for its three minutes that it needs. And we'll go from that straight into putting these oats in and the peanut butter. The worst part's getting the peanut butter out of that cup. Woo! It can be a handful sometimes. I haven't tried it before, but I guess you could actually use like the uh, reduced fat peanut butter if you wanted to. I'm going to get y'all set up over here. Because <laughs> you got to act kind of quick. So, with me. so I'm going to get you set up right here. So that's what I'm going to have my... Uh, one of these days I'll figure this out, y'all. I'm getting better at it though, ain't I? <laughs> We're going to take that off, sit it over here on this hot plate so we don't burn the countertop. Just get things over out of the way. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm going to put my peanut butter in first. Because I can. <laughs> Lick the spoon. Now, not before. 
We don't do that. No, no, no. No licking of the spoon prior to. Good peanut butter, though. Good, good. All right. Y'all know, you hear, my, you hear me back there, right? You gotta put that sink of water in there. So that you'll have things. Oh, of course my phone's ringing. I just can't, just can't get it until now, so. Get that poured in there. We're gonna get this all stirred up real good, makes it really good. You will see that? Get these stirred up real good. You don't want you want it. I mean, you got to do it. Get it stirred up really, really good. Yeah. You're gonna scrape the bottom of that pan, and when you're cooking your chocolate, be sure you scrape the sides of your pan, bottom of your pan. You don't want any scorched chocolate in your cookies. Now, we'll go ahead and pour that vanilla in there. That's two teaspoons of it. Oh, by the way. Y'all can get the full recipe for this and the instructions on my handcrafted by page on Facebook. That's at Nana's Hidden Apron. So, if you, if you use my recipe, let me know what you think about it. Let me know how things turn out. A lot of times, you know, the old-fashioned chocolate candy like that and, and cookies and stuff don't turn out so good depending on the weather. Like the my, it, they call it divinity, but my grandma called it seafoam candy. You have to pick just the right day to use that to make that stuff. Because I'm telling you, you'll just have nothing but a bunch of egg white mess. All right, let me go ahead and finish stirring this up. I know y'all don't want to keep on watching me stir, 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 and stir, but that's what it looks like. And then uh, here in just a few minutes, we'll get to dropping these cookies on my uh, tray that I went ahead and uh, covered with some... Uh, parchment paper and then I've got the smallest cookie uh, scoop that I have that I'm going to use to scoop these out and make them so I'll be back with you in just a few minutes okay I've moved over here to the kitchen counter to I got a little bigger space here a uh, little tip if you don't want your cookie mixture to stick into your um, on your scoop spray it with a little bit of non-stick spray I've got uh, the coconut oil spray but any that you would like to then just go ahead and do that all right let me get you let me get you adjusted down here so you can watch down here what's a happening Alrighty, we have a pretty day here today it's cold but it's pretty outside it's a sunshiny day yeah I know I'm gabbing to you all while I'm trying to get this adjusted for you all right yeah. I have me a fork just in case I need to smoosh them down a little bit. Smoosh. Do you like that word? Smoosh. Smoosh, smoosh, smoosh. See how easy that come out of there? That's, that's a good thing right there. <laughs> They're trying to get away from me. Then if it starts sticking in there, then just spray it again. Over your pan there and give it a spray. It won't hurt anything. <laughs> that noise you heard, that's Tom. He's, he's, uh, they got to let him off work early today since he has to work Saturday. So, he's over there at the table having his lunch. Like I said, you have to be careful because this will start setting up in the pan on you if you if you don't watch it and do it really quick. 
I'm going to scoot these out of the way and grab my other pan. Always have you at least two pans ready, okay? That way, if, uh, if you make bigger ones, obviously you wouldn't need it. But if you're making them the size that I'm using here, I can't tell you what size this is. I don't know. It's not written on here. If it was, I would tell you. But I should get two and a half dozen out of this, I'm thinking. Oops, that one didn't stick together very good, did it? That's okay. Just push it a little bit harder when I scoop it out of the pan. So what's your favorite cookie? You know, I don't even know that I have a favorite cookie. I like a lot of cookies, as you can tell. <laughs> laugh with me, people. Laugh with me. <laughs> and I just want to thank every one of you for subscribing to me, to my channel. Um, I've gone over 100 subscribers now, and that just tickles me. I'm so excited about that. Um... It's a, uh, it just makes me happy. I don't, I don't know how else to, 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 to let y'all know. It just makes me really happy. And I, I appreciate that y'all tolerate my silliness and, uh, not to, definitely in not knowing how to work this machine here. <laughs> I know it's not a machine. It's just a piece of camera equipment. Now I've got a. For some reason, I'm going to have a few more, so I just grabbed my parchment paper out of there, and I'm going to fold it in half and just sit them right here on the counter. It won't hurt it. it won't hurt it at all. <laughs> Tom's having chili. Like I said, it's it's a nice cool day, so I'm sure that's hitting the spot. <laughs> Sound like a cracker might have gotten the way. <laughs> the, the way of his swallowing, though. He's okay. I looked over there at him. He's good. All right. Mmm. -hmm. Would you just look at those? Now, see, he knows when to come home for lunch, don't he? He does. See what happened? And some left over. What do you reckon we should do with that? Hmm. Hmm. What should we do with the leftovers? Um. Could it be that there's two for me and one for Tom? No. Could it be that there's three for me? <gasps> no. <laughs> Could it be there's one for me and two for Tom? I think so. Look over there. Hey, babe. Sorry. Pay no mind to the... To the... Yeah. Hey, it's real life. What can I say? There's clean laundry there waiting to be folded. <laughs> okay. Um, you all, I hope you have a good day. Good rest of the week. Um, I'm going to try to put uh, at least one uh, cookie vlog on here uh, a week up until Christmas. And... Uh, a cookie or a candy or two I mean my son y'all know he's he's working in Florida he'll come in for Christmas has already put in a request for my Kentucky bourbon ball candy y'all already know I'm gonna share that one with you I can't eat it because it has pecans in it but you know you don't get bourbon true bourbon any place but right here in Kentucky so I'm going to share that with y'all. Okay. Um, y'all want me to go ahead and give this a little taste? I think I will. It's not set up yet, but... Can y'all see me? I sure hope you can. There we go. <laughs> Good as always. Mmm. I'm going to put you on hold just a minute. We'll get Tom to... 
give his a try after he finishes his chili. Be right back. All right, babe. Give it a try there. <laughs> Sorry, it's not set up yet. <laughs> it's good, huh? Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Goosebumps. Mm -hmm. That's always a good sign. Okay. <laughs> All right. Again, y'all have a good day. I appreciate you more than you know. Um, if you haven't yet, would you please uh, click the subscribe button? And then there's going to be a dinner bell up in here somewhere. Um, you guys give that a little click and it'll let you know. You'll get uh, notifications for when I put out new vlogs. And if you like this and you're subscribed, please click the like button for me. Again, share some of your thoughts with me. Let me know what you think. If there's something you want me to try to make, I'll do my best and try. Never hurts to try, no matter what age you are. Y'all have a blessed day. See ya.